get all the travel out of it. Then go two rounds. Good to go. Just this is where the adjustment for the tracking on this blade. You adjust this back to adjust the wheel blade that way. Adjust it forward to adjust the blade like this way. This bolt here is just to keep the wheel from rocking back and forth. You can see your brass scrapers and your guide. You can move your guide posts out to this notch for 8 inch wide material. This is the tracking for this side. You adjust the shaft in to run your blade forward, adjust it out to run your blade off. To level your blade from side to side, you do it down here. Loosen this off, tighten one and loosen the other to level this post, which will in turn level your band on your conveyor. This is the adjustment for your blade there for your belt tension. Loosen that nut. Push the motor down to put more tension on your belt. This is your emergency stop. Pull this out to run. This valve adjusts the speed of the motor. This valve adjusts the speed of the conveyor. And if someone gets in the way or something too tall pushes in, that will stop all the hydraulic flow. This is where you hook your power tools, three hot legs, and your ground motor. Most of your disconnect, see this.